Justin Tucker, but you're right, King. There hasn't been the five goals probably the standout right now, but even performance. Oh. Shields. He has something. He's got two. After Hayden Young, he gets a quick kick away. Terra. Back to Conker. They're against the clock. Ten seconds and yep. counting. Terra's kick is deep. They get that last chance. Tabernard. Darcy down there. Was that in the back? No. Shields. Oh, he's kicked the goal right on the siren. In a way, but it's not because he was a border at Geelong Grammar, so he didn't mind living away from home. He'd already lived away from home for a couple of years before he was drafted. King got up there, let it get behind. Maynard tried to get it through that traffic again. It's Saron, the man we're speaking of, pulls the kick late, might still work. Croydon picked it off Mundy's hands, and he goes long. Schultz, he wants to take it on, he needs to roll, he needs to spin, he needs to bounce, he needs the beauty, the beautiful wall beauty of it. Can you believe it? It's coming back to Michael Walters, who I thought Drake did it initially, but then the Kangaroos player stole it off. It was against Marnie. Frederick now. Whipping over the top, Sarong. He's had over 30 touches tonight. Driving ball to the square. Tabata, but Mackay got the spoil. But Schultz was waiting to poach it. And Lockie Schultz has kicked four. A big night for the small forward. Long launch. Touch was the call, so lob flies. He wasn't going to be paid the mark even if he took it. Dumping tackle. Kick around the body looks pretty good. It's there. He got it there just. Oh. And then he turned it over. Lob. They can take the lead back here. Schultz looks up from 50. We might have the finish to beat all finishes coming up at the Adelaide Oval. Finals-like atmosphere at the moment. Ball in the Wiedemann direction, but he's outmarked by Pierce. Another contested mark that you're talking about. They're doing very well in the air, the Dockers. It's a real challenge from Wiedemann and from Brown and the kid key forwards. They get, they're not only not winning uh, contests, they're getting outmarked. Pulls the kick in the tab in a direction. Got a paw on it. Couldn't complete it. Lever and Hunt looked at each other. As Hunt's ball. Pocket pick by Schultz. Wow! For belief rising in the eyes of Fremantle. And they come straight back out again. And maybe, maybe Hawthorne are starting to play around them. Frost in the ruck. Got it down. So wrong. Slick hands. Five. Brody. Mundy trying to break away. And they just keep it moving forward, willing it to try to send it inside 50. Sarong again. Walters! He launched, but he made the contest, and Schultz was able to dribble the kick underneath his opponent and find a way to go. Young. Darcy in the middle. Fife, great handball as he went to ground. Banfield tackled and tackled high. Advantage will be taken by Fremantle. And they've got some extra numbers. Brayshaw's hard running as he just hacks it forward into the path of Lobb. They've got a man on in the square. Lobb sends it in that direction. Schultz has to wait an eternity. Couldn't mark. Time to recover. Little sidestep. And that punishes with just seconds remaining. Banfield. Sees Fife now pushing forward. Schultz has kicked three. This will be the best of them all. Schultz has kicked four. And it's going to be hard from here for the Swans. Uh, the centre clearance, but behind the ball as well, the Dockers. Right to have Matthew Pavlis downstairs with us. Dunkley's getting a fair bit of it in this third, although he's been put to grass by Neil and Brayshaw out the front. This time, Schultz gets his moment. And this time, the big moment man nails it. Sturt just lays it up. Looking for a flight, Duggan spoils, Schultz roaming, got it to his boot in the blink of an eye. Playing some sort of game, Lockie Schultz with four. Wagner from long range to the goal square. Cox from one way, aim on the other. Schultz, he put it all together in his mind and he executed it. Absolutely pinpoint perfect.